Hey guys, so I don't know what to title this. It's not a public service announcement. It's not a walk. Obviously, I'm not walking. So uh, let's call this Dad's on a Rant. Um, I have a, a loaner vehicle here that I'm actually just about to turn back in and pick my truck up. This is a 2020 Silverado. 2020 or 2021. It's got 1,600 miles on it. Uh, so practically brand new. So it should be fairly modern for what Chevy's offering. And I don't get it. I don't understand why Chevy makes some of the decisions that they make. It's not bad to drive. It's decently comfortable, decently peppy, gets okay gas mileage for the size of this thing. I mean, this is the, the crew cab long bed, so it's, I mean, it's not small, but it's getting 20s, low 20s for miles per gallon. It's not bad. What I don't get is the interior. There are things about this truck that pretty much guarantee I will never own one. And some of them are pretty simple. like. The door handles, these little plastic things that I just don't want to grab onto every day. It's one of those same problems I had with the Chevy HHR back when they made that. But I'll tell you the biggest one. The biggest issue I have in this truck is the stereo. Now, it doesn't sound great, clear. I mean, there's no bass response at all. That's not the issue though. You got this massive screen. This is like an eight point something inch screen, 8.7, something like that. But look at the tiny little area that they give you to look at the name of the song. If you're going FM, so you're not going serious or anything else, you get this tiny, tiny little two inches of space and they take the name of the song and they're just rotating it over and over in this tiny little space. You have all of this extra real estate that they're just giving to a blue gradient image and I can't figure out why. If you're gonna give me an 8.7 inch screen or whatever this thing is, use it. Why, why are we dedicating so much space to nothing and forcing me to try to figure out on a song like this who the heck the artist is and what the title of the song is when I could just view the whole thing on one screen? So auto manufacturers, Chevy in particular, get it together. This isn't hard. It's 2020. You're using massive screens. Use them, please. All right, so I'm back in my truck now. My truck is a 2014 Dodge Ram. Similar size screen. We're talking six years ago compared to the Silverado we were just in. And look at this. I can easily see the name of the station. I've got the name. I've got the whole name of the song. Yeah, there's a little bit of a crawl in the middle for the parts that flow over, but they're actually using the entire screen. And we won't even talk about how much better the screen in the middle of the dashboard is. And we'll do that at a later time. But Chevy, really, figure it out. Let's go, you guys make a pretty decent car normally. Let's work it out. Okay, that's the end of my rant. I won't go any further than that. Since we are talking about radios and music, I will lighten things up with a dad joke. So, what does the musician, or what did the musician name his identical twin daughters? No idea. And a one, and a two. All right guys, have a good day, stay safe. Talk to you soon.